Hi, Paul from ElkinsDIY.com. Once again, I'm playing around with a little shelter for my Tommy Bahama uh, chair. Now, I use this to go out and uh, do landscape drawing called plain air. I use pastel chalk. Sometimes the weather around the northwest gets kind of foul. So, hence the shelter. And it protects me from the sun. My next iteration is going to attach to the chair. Here's the drawing. Now let's get started. Welcome to my portable art studio. You may have seen my last shelter that I made that encompassed the whole chair. That's nice, but um, I kind of like this better. It's smaller, lighter, less material. It's just one sheet of coroplast and a bunch of Velcro tabs. That's all it is. Basically attached right here and on the back arm. Um, right here I split it down the center. keeps the two pieces of staying in an arc and I cut it up in such a way that it all folds up into a 40 inch by 18 inch wide thing that you can just walk around with. I got all of my pastels here. In the past I'd have them on the ground in the wet grass or wherever, hard to reach. I now have them at easily accessibility here. Place for glasses. Here's some even more room for old pastel chalks. These old ones I've had kicking around for like 14 years. When I was in college, I did a lot of pastel drawing. That's kind of where I learned this. And uh, so these are kind of dirty and grungy. You really don't know what color they are. So I put this scratch pad on here so I can kind of tell what color I'm doing. This little pocket came off the side of the chair. Little pouch is good for storing my little lunch. Here's for my phone. I'm using my phone right now to record this. I can also use the phone right here and watch a YouTube or listen to Pandora or whatever. The Tommy Bahama chair is the bomb. Gives you a little insulated cooler down here if you want to carry food. Another big pouch. It's just enough from all of my art supplies. This guy here helps keep the shelter from going side to side when side winds come. And this helps from the keeping the air from blowing through and also keeps the sun off the back of my neck and it keeps it kind of quiet inside I like it this morning when I was testing it out in the rain it was kind of raining on my shoes a little bit and I needed an extra seven inches so I had this little extra piece of came off of the sheet of making this added it to the shelter and now my feet are dry
I had this extra piece of chloroplast that works pretty good for a little table. Instead of throwing my lunch in my lap, got a little table I could lay stuff out of. It's kind of nice. So, pretty simple. It's pretty sturdy. I wouldn't take it into a gale wind, of course, but for mild to moderate uh, weather and if it's sprinkling, which I tried this out today, stay dry, just as long as the wind isn't blowing too hard. So there you have it, folks. Thanks for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.